In this video, we'll balance the net ionic equation for Ca plus FeNO33. This is calcium and iron 3 nitrate. This is a single displacement reaction. The calcium that pushes the iron out, and the iron ends up by itself. The calcium, that's then bonded with the nitrate. First, when we do net ionic equations, we need to balance the molecular equation. This one, I can see that I have three of these nitrates here. So I want to get that to an even number. I'll put it two. Now I have two times the three nitrates. That's six. I'm going to put a three here. Two times the one, that's two. Two times three is six. The nitrates are balanced. I see I have two irons. I'll put a two here. Three calciums. Put a three here. That's the balanced molecular equation. Next, we need to write the state for each substance. Calcium, that's a metal. That's a solid metal. So we're going to put S for that. Nitrates are very soluble. AQ, more nitrates here, calcium nitrate, that's soluble. And then iron by itself, that's going to be a metal. So we have our states. Next, we split the strong electrolytes into their ions for the complete ionic equation. Calcium, that's a metal, so we just have it by itself, 3Ca. I'll write the states later. Let's not do that now. Iron's a transition metal. We don't know the charge, but we know the nitrate ion is always 1 minus. And I have three of them. So 3 minus, the iron has to be 3 plus. So two of these iron 3 ions. And then for the nitrates, we have the one nitrate here. So 3 times 1, 3 times 2, 6 nitrate ions. And these are the reactants in our net ionic equation for the products. Calcium is in group 2. That's 2 plus. We said the nitrate, 1 minus, 3 calcium ions, and then two nitrate ions times three. So again, we have six nitrate ions, and then we just have the two iron, two Fe. So this is the complete ionic equation. Now we can cross out spectator ions. They're on both sides of the complete ionic equation. The only thing I'm seeing that's the same in the reactants and the products is this nitrate ion here. So I'm going to cross that out, and that'll leave the net ionic equation for Ca plus FeNO3. Let me clean it up. I'll write the states. We'll have our net ionic equation. And this is the balanced net ionic equation for calcium plus iron 3 nitrate. You'll notice that the charge is balanced. I have 2 times 3 plus. That's 6 plus on the reactant side. 3 times 2 plus here. That gives us 6 plus. So charge is the same on both sides. And if you count the atoms up, they're balanced as well. This is Dr. B with the balanced net ionic equation for Ca plus FeNO33. Thanks for watching.